In Charles City, we're just under 7,400 people. We're a county seat rural community, so we're not a huge community, but we are the urban center for a, for a large area. About 10 years ago, Charles City put in the first uh, whitewater park in the state of Iowa. We've recently taken on being the city of murals. You know, we're doing a lot of murals around the community, just all sorts of amenities that we're trying to build. We've been talking about various approaches to trying to address the housing um, issue in Charles City for years. And very fortunate we've had a lot of business growth over the last several years. Most recently, two of our main pharmaceutical companies have announced large expansions. One of them's adding 70 jobs, and the other one's adding another 30 jobs. Couple that with our chicken plant that's reopened, and they're gonna be adding 500 jobs over the course of the next couple of years. We're trying to do something good for town and we're trying to encourage young families to move to Charles City. So we decided to build these townhouses. We want to make the most of our, our community and uh, enhance it uh, as we can. And I think this project and this investment we're making in housing for our community is a first step of many to come. We need a lot, but someone had to do it, so we stepped up. We hope to be able to, to, to share our story in Charles City on the things we've been able to accomplish for a small town within the housing realm, but also learn from others on what they've done to really kind of be that piece that, that puts a developer over the hump on whether they want to come here or not. We're really persistent and we're going at it, but it's going to take some time. And my hope is that developers hear that cry and they come and they meet that need because we have people that are excited and they want to be here and they want to be part of the community. The demand's here. I think if you build it, they will come. Yeah.